having also um, gone to the Art Commission uh, for a distinctive sidewalk approval, the uh, Skyscraper Museum actually won approval as well, and I can absolutely commiserate with the effort that you went through in order to achieve this very, very beautiful uh, uh, work of art. Uh, we do have a, a video of it, and I think maybe we'll try to load it up uh, and show it in the background as we have the discussion so that we can try to keep everything else going apace. And so um, if it's okay, then I'll, I'll, we'll, we'll move on to 48 um, Bond, and I'll do a quick introduction. Actually, Ian, you want to come up and start loading their PowerPoint. A uh, quick introduction of the participants uh, then, uh, with beginning with ladies first and the architects, Deborah Burke. Uh, is an architect who um, has a firm with her her own name and where she's been practicing for, um, it's hard to believe here, but it's, um, it's like 26 years when I do the addition. Um, she's also a very well-known uh, professor at Yale where she teaches architectural design and has for many years and has um, many students who uh, have been influenced by her, her studio um, work. She's also the co-editor with Stephen Harris of an important book called The Architecture of the Everyday. Uh, she'll have a second um, book coming out um, this fall, which is a monograph on the firm's work. But I think The Architecture of the Everyday um, is, is the kind of tag that has often been described, um, uh, often been used to describe um, Deborah's work. Uh, um, in a very self-effacing way, uh, because the, clearly, as you will see in this presentation, uh, the vernacular character that she absorbs in her work is um, maybe inspired by every day, but the significant subtleties um, of the modernism that she brings to the work um, bring it far above um, the vernacular. Uh, her clients in this case uh, are Romy Goldman, uh, who is the founder and president of Gold Development and has more than 14 years of experience in real estate development and construction management. She, before founding Gold Development, she was a senior project manager at Site Design Building. She has long been active in the arts and historic preservation realms and has um, served on U.S. Commission of the Arts. Um, in addition to uh, doing high-end Bond Street uh, loft uh, apartments, he also has for many, many years been uh, involved in the field of affordable housing, which is how I first um, came to know him and become, uh, become friends with him uh, over the years. So um, with the, this three of the team of 48 Bond will now present the project, and I will advance your slides as, as you tell me to.